<clears throat> Alright, hey, Shalom. I want to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Chakadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who were well. Much peace and mercy to the old Lelet. Shibbat and Shar. And uh, it's going to be just a quick, quick video through the spirit of power of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. And you know, as I said before in the previous video, we're out here in Vegas. You know, you can see the little sights or whatever. Um, basically, you know, it's no, it's not a problem to enjoy yourself. You know, when when you go to uh, <clears throat> Ecclesiastes, it says there's nothing good but that a man enjoys labors. You know, when you uh, drink some some yan yan and, and lay back you might go out a little bit you know it refreshes your spirit but anyway <clears throat> basically um you know yeah this place is this place is through man you know when uh when we were walking the streets in vegas it's like two completely different worlds you know you got the you got the people out there that's gambling you got the people that's out there as tourists you know you got the you know got the locals but ultimately, you know, you also have uh, a lot of homeless. You got a lot of homeless. You got a lot of people, on, you know, struggle out on drugs. You know, you got a lot of people, you know, bugged out through, you know. And it uh, dawned on me like, damn, like, you know, these people are really living in the delusion. You know, you, you, you literally have men, women going to casinos putting in 200 300 dollars into a machine pressing a button just throwing away money you know a lot you know what yeah you might hit whatever but you you will lose more than you, you actually win so these people are just throwing money away you know, throwing money away throwing money away throwing money away throwing money away and then you got homeless men homeless women homeless children but nothing, you know, asking for money, homeless, need help, hungry. Now, a lot of these people are homeless and, 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 and bugged out and all drugged up because of their own actions, of course. But there's that separation between where, um, there's that separation between uh, uh, these people and, and their tourist life and, and the locals and, and, and they they out here, man. They out here, thugging it out in the heat. You know, I seen so many so many men, women, laying on the floor, laying laying down by the escalators, and the, you know what I'm saying, in in very populated areas, just 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 laying because they got nowhere else to go. So the point that I'm making is this: it's not gonna be like this in the kingdom, man. It's not gonna be like this in the kingdom. This this huge. This huge poverty rate, you know. When Israel is in power, man, the whole earth will rejoice. The reason why the earth is mourning, as it is written, uh, when the wicked are in power, the, the the earth mourning. But when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. So when when the Israelites, went, starting with Yahushai, you know the elect. 144,000 gets in power this whole earth will be refreshed this whole earth will rejoice from the the people to the trees to the birds the plane not the the, 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 bird, the planes <laughs> yeah but this whole earth will rejoice man all the animals the bugs right they're not they don't have to deal with chemtrails and uh there was one thing that i um came across basically the reason why birds or you know, uh, you know chirp so loud is because they're trying to overpower like the ambient noise of traffic and you know factories and different things like that so they have to exert themselves more you see and this could cause them to uh, damage themselves you know maybe even beyond repair but ultimately Everything is out of out of whack, man. Scriptures say that the, all the foundations of the of, of the earth is out of course. 
you know? And it's all starting and all going back to this damn devil, Esau Edom. The Lord is about to destroy this man. He has completely and utterly uh, polluted and destroyed this, this whole world, man, this whole earth. So we need, we need, we need a new authority on this earth. We need it. It's not a matter of, oh, you know, we, we, we can get by. No, we cannot. The scriptures say, um, if the Lord had not shortened the time, no flesh will be will, will be saved. Because this man, look at what he's doing, man. He's putting, uh, he's making uh, GMOs, the impossible meat, right? He's he's making he's making uh, 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 food out of bugs, man, crickets and 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 and, and things like that, and calling it food. Oh yeah, just uh, these cricket protein, you know. This is the best protein out. And, and I'm not saying so much as just crickets, but it could be whatever, man. Unlawful insects, you know, because Esau you ain't gonna use no. Or, uh, clean animals and insects or keep creeping things. He's gonna use those unclean be uh, bugs. You know, I think beetles are clean, but anyway. <clears throat> point that I'm making is this. This man has to go, man. This place has to go. We gotta get the hell up out of here, man. We gotta, we gotta get the hell up out of here. Because, you know, in, in, in your folly, you know, the spirit will kick in, and you start to see just how terrible this place is. As it is written, uh, arise ye in the park, but this is not your rest, because it's polluted, man. You can, only a delusional person could live in these current situations, in these current, <clears throat> in these current um, situations, predicaments, it's not the word that I'm looking for, but you have to be very delusional to accept this kind of uh, uh, society, man. You're not living in reality. All of these, all of the homeless, man, it's, it's, it's crazy sad. You know, people going out clubbing at night, you still, you, you know what I'm saying? Motherfucker, uh, uh, the, you know, the homeless out there, Looking, looking in, trying to see if somebody gonna come out with some food they don't want. Bro, this shit is wicked, man. And it's sickening. It's very sickening. Because as 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 the previous owners and rulers of this world, you know, we should be angry right now, man. We should be angry. This that was. This is scripture say that the earth was created for our sakes. Our sakes, not for Esau, not for the heathen. For, for Jacob and and look what this devil has turned it into man so the scriptures say that what the heavenly father is going to destroy them that destroyed the earth who is that who, who destroyed the earth who, who who got the chemtrails in the air who got all of these factories puffing up um, you know these different gases cars man just just burning gasoline alone is is it, there's a reason why it's called the exhaust. It's, it's pumping all of them fumes out into the solar system. And to the, uh, I ain't gonna lie to you, man. Let's be with <laughs> Let me get this side. It's amazing, bro. And this is just, this is the, the, um, what is it called? Mm. But yeah, man, this is, you know, the view is nice. You know, you see the little mountains in the background. But bad when when all when when the Lord destroyed this place, bro. When the Lord destroyed this place, when the Lord take this place out, bro, lay this shit flat. Look at all of this shit, bro. You a person would never think coming coming to this place and looking at this, like, bro, this is this is it. This is gonna this is how this is society. This is what we gotta deal with forever. But our hope and our prayer is. The Heavenly Father sends his son. And 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 you know, we hey, World War Three pops off and them missiles hit this bitch, man. That's our hope and our, our faith. And that when before those missiles hit this place, the elect be delivered. Lord willing we be of it. Lord willing we be of that number. You know. 
We got to continue in this work, though. Keep fighting. Keep pushing. You know, one thing uh, the brother the brother been saying a lot often recently is if you don't make mistakes, you can't learn from them. You know, if you make a mistake, learn from your mistake and move move forward. You know, keep examining yourself and keep growing in the spirit. You know, as as a spiritual man, that new man, a new that new creature, continue to grow as that new creature. You see, and the Lord, the Lord will take care of you. The Lord is going to take care of His men. Scripture say in Isaiah six, uh, what's that, sixty? 5.13 Service of the Lord shall eat, drink and be and rejoice So we have to endure this man We have to endure this this society Because Esau is coming down man he, He's about to come down Scripture say Revelation 12 and 12 Because he has a short time Right He's going to come down with great wrath So prepare your soul Prepare your mind Prepared to be persecuted, to be lied on, slandered. Prepare your soul. Yeah, how shy went through it. So you know we're gonna have to go through the same. And, and pray that the Heavenly Father gives you the spirit to endure it, to endure it, and to endure until the end. That's pretty much it, you know. Lord willing, this was edifying, faith boosting, giving all praises again to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, Shalom.